got after it, uh, scrimmaged a lot, and they won. But but uh, Mike made it clear to us that uh, y'all had to extend practice to get that victory. Yeah, yeah. Um, you know, one of the things we talked about in film today was, you know, uh, building our principles, and one of the biggest things we talked about was competing. Uh, day one, you know, it was good competition right there. Capella had pressure on him for that free throw? Yeah, yeah. Clint make that free throw, we win. So uh, that's good, man. He went up there, confidence, knocked it down. Is this the way it always person. is when you're out in the, uh, in the, in the practice? I mean, the you're out there pushing. You were pushing. Everybody was kind of pushing each other, but it seemed like you were pushing them a little bit more. Uh, that's me. I play to win. I don't care if it's Connect Four, if it's Jenga, no matter what it is, we, we play to win. And, we got a lot of guys on our team, I think, with a lot of grit. And, you know, we, we build on days like this. You mentioned the principles to put in. Were there any that were specific to this group, to this team? Anything any different from what you've experienced before? Uh, every team is always different. Uh, we talked about how we want to play. We talked about uh, defending. And, um, yeah, a lot of stuff we talked about. But uh, this, this is day one for me. I'm still figuring it out. I know that um, it's on paper right now, but when you're here and you see all these weapons actively around you, what do you think? Uh, I get excited about it. I get excited about it, but at the same time, uh, on paper never does anything for you. You got to build, and I think that's what we've been doing uh, day in and day out. We got to build that trust, um, knowing we're capable of on the offensive end. You know, we got to defend. Mm -hmm. You caught an elbow on it uh, on Demetrius's drive. We knew right away you were okay, or you kind of checking Which things one? out for a minute. Right near the end. Uh, oh, I caught a knee. Oh, was I it a knee? A knee. Yeah, I caught a knee. But, uh, That's worse. I was cool. Things happen. Yeah. Where, where did he get you? Pretty high up? He got me. Okay, gotcha. gotcha. <laughs> so, <laughs> I just stopped asking about that. Huh? Right, right. Yeah. How good do you think Clint can be? Oh, uh, man. Clint's great, man. I mean, seriously, like, um, I don't know. I'm excited about this season uh, with him and for him. You know, he just does his job, plays hard. Uh, defends, rebounds, and uh, he runs. The thing that I, I think I've been harping on him a lot about is making sure the defense is his, you know, letting us hear his voice and taking control of it. This is our first time to, to cover you like this. What are some things you like to work on early in camp, right off the bat? What do you want to do? Um, a lot of things. Uh, get that get that cardio up. Uh, the way we play, you know, it's up-tempo and stuff like that. Uh, just keep getting better all around, finishing, shooting, and uh, figuring out how we're going to play. I saw you sitting with uh, Mike a while ago for a few minutes. Yeah. How much do you appreciate the lines communication between oh, man. coach player? Oh, man, it's unbelievable. It's, uh, it's unbelievable. Uh, just the communication. Uh, coach and Tony just not only with me, Jane, it's with everybody. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? He, he truly has that open door policy. And uh, there's no egos. You know, we just all try to figure it out. Mm -hmm. How much of what Clint does kind of reminds you of DeAndre Jordan? Uh, everybody's their own player, you know what I mean? But, uh, you know, DJ was, uh, you know, raw at one point, too. But he put a lot of work in. You know, I talk to Clint about that all the time, the way the way DJ worked to become who he is now. Uh, it's a process, and there's no reason why Clint can't, can't do the same. Chris, does experience switch to already once when you went over to L.A.? Does that help kind of get you prepared for what you expect here when you're starting with a brand new team? Uh, no, everybody? no, not really, just because every experience is different. Um, that time, I might have been like 25, 26, something like that, so things change or whatnot, but uh, I don't know, I don't know. It's a new experience, not only for me, but for my family, and I've just been trying to embrace the whole process of it. Does Thank it feel you. a little bit like maybe a team that you kind of built? Because this is a team that you chose, and you also picked up P.J. Tucker, someone that you recruited. Uh, somewhat, somewhat. Um, I guess, I guess. I don't know. I'm, I'm still figuring a lot of things out, but I, I'm happy now that we're actually playing basketball and we're getting a chance to, to put it all together.